A West Jordan family wants to know who is targeting their horses, committing an unusual crime they say has happened three times now. Fox 13's Lauren Steinbrecher shows us what's happening and why it is so troubling. Taylor Armbruster's always over at her mom's house. We all just enjoy spending time with them. Hanging out with the horses, Susie Q, Bobby, and Henry, taking care of the trio, which right now means scheduling vet appointments. After Taylor's mom noticed a week ago, someone else had come to see the horses. You can see the different hack marks. Lopping off Susie and Bobby's tails, which is weird in and of itself until you find out this is the third time a hair thief's harassed them. They've altered her quality of life for the summer. We first did a story with Taylor and other horse owners in October of 2018, when their Missouri Fox Trotter Sage's tail was chopped off. Well, they actually broke her tailbone. Um, and so there wasn't just a haircut, there was actual breakage of her tailbone. Sage later passed away. In September 2019, Susie was targeted next. Now, exactly two years later, Susie again and Bobby. They think the person also went for Henry. His tailbone is pretty bruised. We just want to know why. Uh, why us? Is it is it spite? Are we being targeted? There is some interest in horse hair. Sometimes they're used in uh, musical instruments, stringed instruments. Um, sometimes people might use them for crafts or jewelry. West Jordan police are investigating, but no leads between the three years. They've taken no reports from anyone else. They say this person could potentially face animal cruelty, but at the very least, criminal mischief or trespassing. Taylor says the horses can't swat away flies and tails take years and years to regrow. Her message for whoever is doing this to the animals, she considers family. It's not funny. It's not a prank. It's cruel. Um, you know, forget the trespassing part. You're hurting our animals. In West Jordan, Lawrence Steinbrecher, Fox 13 News, Utah.